Welcome to Fort Worth, Texas, home of the TCU Horned Frogs, the newest member of the Big 12 Conference. I'm Barry Trammell. We're down in Fort Worth chatting with TCU officials about their excitement of joining the Big 12. Look for some of those interviews coming up on News OK. We also got a tour of TCU facilities. Amon G. Carter Stadium undergoing a $165 million makeover. Assistant Athletic Director Mark Cohen gave us a tour. But when all is said and done, it's going to be a facility that seats 45,000. We call it the Camden Yards of college football stadiums. There might be bigger stadiums, but there won't be any nicer than our facility. It's a sense of pride for the city of Fort Worth, the entire Metroplex. The TCU football team, literally any day now, will be moving into its nearly 10,000 square foot locker room. It's actually at the same location where the old weight room used to be. The old weight room moved to the uh, other side of the indoor facility, and that new weight room is almost 20,000 square feet. But the new locker room is adjoined with the new sports medicine center. All the latest technology is in there, including our beloved underwater treadmill. We also have a new press box that we know the media will enjoy the vantage point, 125 seats, as nice as there is in the country. Kind of the running joke, we say there's so much going on at TCU, whether it's with the football facilities, the stadium, across campus with the dorms, the academic buildings, that TCU almost stands for Texas Construction University. One of the defining features of the stadium is how fan friendly it is. It's got a very open feel to it. There's not a bad seat in the house. We've sold out of season tickets. There's a waiting list. It's really a hot ticket in Fort Worth and throughout the Metroplex. 